Now let's head over to Bauchi where a youth group has expressed the need for youth to reduce reliance on government and reach out to the needy, challenging what the group calls the wealthy. They distribute food and relief materials to the needy and vulnerable in Bauchi to complement the Ramadan fasting season. Awal Hassan from Bauchi tells us more. Well, I am happy that you do not expect me to challenge the government because we've been challenging the government all this while and nothing has changed. So This is the opinion of some youth in Bauchi who believe that the time for them to invest in the future is now. We will challenge the youths because they need to invest in the future because they belong to it. The leaders are not investing in the future because it is not necessary that they belong to the future. As a 25 year old now, I expect myself, maybe if God so wishes, to be still alive in the next 50 perhaps. Especially in a time when too many Nigerians have had their dreams snatched from them, uh, when our leaders have failed to improve the living standard of the average Nigerians. So we feel that uh, we owe our people a debt, uh, which is to lend uh, our hands abund uh, in abundance to them. For this widow and mother of five Fatima Muhammad and others alike, this is a life changer. <laughs> The youth group known as Hyder Care Foundation believe that it is the responsibility of everyone, not just the government, to extend helping hands to others as a way of reducing social atrocities. We all know that um, it is our collective responsibility to make sure that our society is devoid of all atrocities, including hunger. And um, since the leadership we have now is not adequate, we need other people, private individuals per se, who would add this purpose also. Maybe uh, people don't mingle with, uh, with the poor, but I'm surely someone of you have been approached by numerous people to render assistance for, for different causes. You will be troubled at the group between the magnitude of people challenges and the high valuing promises of some politicians. These youth group constantly engage in community service like this because they believe this is a true leadership and they are ready to lead by example. Awal Hassan, Viewer TV News, Bochi.